Hello everyone, welcome to the final episode of our Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories playthrough on our road to Kingdom Hearts 3 and part of our Proud Mode playthrough on the PlayStation 4 of all of the Kingdom Hearts titles. Thank you so much for coming and joining me today. I'm so excited to get into this last episode of Chain of Memories. I guess you decided not to go to sleep. All right, here we have Mickey. He's up to How date you know with that? what we're doing. I heard it from Diz. He spoke with Diz. Diz is still kind of a shady character to me. Uh, he was introduced to us in the last episode, and we don't know anything about him other than he pretended to be him? Ansem, well, and I guess he much. and Naminé kind of helped us get through the castle. Somewhere. Hey, who are you? I could be nobody or anybody. Yeah, that's super true. His face is all wrapped up. We don't know what he looks like or anything. To believe in me or not. I don't know if Boy, you really like pushing decisions on other people. If uh, King Mickey trusts him, you have well, I could trust him. Slumber, making the choice to face Ansem. Oh yeah. We're going to fight Ansem. Dude, so much better to fight Ansem than to just go to sleep and not fight oh, Ansem, right? Like that would be so boring. Oh, an organization coat? What's this? The organization will pursue you. Like a pack of hunting dogs, they will sneak up on you if they sense your presence. Whoa. However, this cloak that is worn by nobodies will render their eyes. Oh, that's why all the that's that could be one reason why all the organization wears those cloaks so that they can't be detected, right? That's cool. To give themselves protection from being devoured by darkness. Oh, and they can't be devoured by darkness. That's super cool. Even the organization cannot rule the darkness. Because that, I mean, that's what happened to like, in in uh, Kingdom Hearts One, like with, uh, I think Clayton is the first one that comes to mind that like his darkness took over his heart. So with that cloak, we can't be consumed by our darkness. Man, that's awesome. Come on. Let's go. Yeah, let's do it. I'm gonna fight Ansem. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't at least a little bit nervous. Fighting Ansem in Kingdom Hearts 1 was so hard. So let's see what we've got here. Castle Oblivion. Cool, we've got the Castle Oblivion card that will draw out our heart's darkness so that we can fight Ansem. Yeah, even King Mickey feels like he's met Diz somewhere before. I wonder if if Diz is even his real name, right? Like his face and stuff is all covered up. I have no idea who he is. This card. <clears throat> Draw Ansem out. Don't worry. We can defeat him together. Yeah, man. If we got Mickey, we can't lose. There's no way. Oh. But why? Man, Riku's no going full lone this, wolf. I do on my own. But I do need He's gonna do it all on his own. What if a guy! Is the victor, he's going to enslave me. If that happens, use your powers to destroy. Of course, I'll be right there to save you. Huh? No, th that's not it. I want you to destroy. No way! No matter <laughs> he's what not even I'm letting us get it out. I'm gonna be right there to help you. I promise you that. What a guy! Unless you don't believe I'll come through for you. Ooh. I choose to believe in you. <laughs> Always, Your Majesty. And I in you. You're not gonna lose. I know it. Thanks. Sweet. All right, let's get a quick save on. But before we go in, we're at 9.47. We could probably beat this game inside of 10 hours. I hope. I mean, I know that there's going to be a lot of cutscenes and stuff, but I'm sure we could do it. You'd never let the darkness get the best of you. I'm, I'm sure of that. All right. Thanks, Mick. All right, everyone. Here we go. Let's get our Castle Oblivion card on. Clench your butts. Here we go. Dang, I feel like there should be some like freaking epic music as we walk in to face our darkness, right? I don't know what that is. And I probably can't put it in because it would be copyrighted and 
And, uh, well, I mean, what are they gonna do? They can't demonetize my video. I'm too small to be monetized Hansel, in the first place, right? Where are you? Show yourself! Anyway. <laughs> Come on, Ansem. Why in such a hurry? I'll be here at the very heart of darkness. Ollie Ollie Oxen free sucker. Plunge into the same darkness inside of you. <laughs> Alright, we gotta get through this world and Ansem's gonna be at the end. It's not like instant boss fight. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Castle Oblivion. Man, I remember how big Castle Oblivion was when we played Asora, right? There was like freaking 50 rooms. It was ridiculous. And it was super, super hard. I'm kind of hoping that it's not like that, but if it is, we're gonna have a bad time. Oh, yo! There's only three rooms. Oh, this is gonna be so easy. <clears throat> All right, 39 cards. I like that. That's very good. We got a potion. We've got lots of enemy cards. Okay, a lot of the same. Obliterate, confuse. Those would only really be good against them, um, uh, against Heartless, right? Not, not against Ansem. That, I, I mean, just speaking from past experiences. All right, man. Ten hours playing uh, as Riku. It seems like a lot of time, but like very quickly as well. I love how fast and how strong Riku feels. That's really cool. Oh man, they broke our two Mickeys. No! Our Mickeys! Take that! And another one! Yeah, Dark Break! Oh man, we got lucky that we uh, bounced on the, on the wizards because we were going after the Neo Shadow that was under the ground. Like, in his shadow mode. Ah, oh, we just missed that big experience thing. Only 2,700 away, so we should level up pretty easily. Whoa, another wave. Okay, we might even level up from this wave. I don't know. Ah, uh, we missed. What? <laughs> Alright, let's get another inverse burst. Oh man, look at our, our D points. One more hit, and we're, we're gonna get forced out of our dark mode. Let's bounce on these fools. Yeah! That was sweet. Oh, dang. Next level, 764. Okay, so, like, next fight, pretty much for sure. Okay, this fight, I'm hoping for sure we can level up because we could either use the extra attack or the extra health to survive our fight with Ansem. Whoa, there's so many magic dudes. We gotta get our dark mode so then we can, um... Yeah, there we go. Now we can do like a dark break and just bounce on all of them. Look at that spin. There we go. Okay, getting the wizards out first is fine too. Whichever, it doesn't. I'm not picky. Kaboom! We'll plow through all these guys with our inverse burst. Yeah, level up, baby! Let's go, Mickey. You and me, pal. Yeah! Oh, dang it, I thought I finished him. Alright, yeah, see, now it'll suck up all that experience and... Cool. Next level, 9516. Okay. So it seems like we get, like, maybe two or 3,000 per fight. That's not bad. Get some more HP. Look at that. We have a lot of health. That's excellent. That's what you want. Look at all these stunned Neo Shadows. Man, these guys are hard. Um... Yeah, I remember there was that one time in the end of the world in Kingdom Hearts 1 where we had the room randomly spawn Neo Shadows, and that's a that's an HD remix kind of exclusive. That was not in the the originally released game, and those freaking Neo Shadows, even though we were like the strongest um, that we were gonna be, they freaking kicked my butt. They're so hard. It's because they can just teleport. Like, not only can they shadow mode, but they can teleport and they hit really hard so feels good to kind of be able to trounce these guys you know okay Ooh, dang let's get a dark Baraga! oh man it didn't do the circle the thing where it like circles them until it until he resurfaces all right we get our inverse burst nice wow 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 <laughs> wow that we got a lot of guys with that that was good 
Ooh, good catch. That third hit. There we go. Awesome. So, so far, Castle Oblivion is not that bad. I think we're having an easier time with it as Riku than we did um, when we played as Sora and came through here. So, that's all very good. Okay, we've got some of the little fire magic guys. I don't remember what they're called, but they're classical music genres. <laughs> and a bunch of Neo Shadows and a Dark Ball. There you go. One down. Let's get that Mickey if we can. Yeah, nice. Dark Viraga. I'm really glad that Dark Viraga does not um, heal those guys. Heal the... Oh, no. We missed it. Man, I hate that. I hate that the experience can just disappear. Like, that's... That's terrible. If it disappears, we should it should just automatically like we should just get it. You know what I mean? Dang man. I'm like absorbed to try to fight these guys and so I can't I can't get all the experience and it's not fun to get, you know, punished for that. But But whatever, that's just one aspect of the game. I don't think it's like that in any other game. So They did it for this one, it didn't work, and that's fine because they don't <laughs> they don't do it again. Yeah, Dark Aura. Oh, that wasn't as many uh, zooms as I thought it was. Or as like I remember it being. Dang, our inverse burst freaking clobbered that guy. That was awesome. I don't remember it doing that much damage. So, All right, well, I'm going to keep going through the next couple levels, and uh, I'll see you guys in a sec. I'll be right back. All right, here we are. I'm back, and we're outside the Room of Truth to fight Ansem. We need 13 points. There we go, and the key to key of begin. Oh, sorry, of beginnings. Key of beginnings. I don't know what I'm talking about. Freaking, we haven't seen a Room of Truth or a Key of Truth since we played a Sora, right? Like, what the heck? All right, Key of Beginnings. I smell you, Ansem. We come to fight Ansem. Show yourself. He's like a like one of those ghost hunters, right, in the haunted house. That's like, "Hey, ghost, where are you?" you fight. I know your strength. Your skill with darkness has grown. It has become more mature. Nice. Our darkness powers are marinating inside of us like a fine wine. Why do you accept the darkness, but still refuse me? Well, you're a jerk, man. You know you and I. That's why. We both follow where the darkness leads. Indeed, we are the same. So why? Does some part of your heart still have a fear of the dark? That's not it. The truth is... I just can't stand your foul stench. Ah, <laughs> nice. Riku, he's always so inflammatory. I love it. He doesn't mess around. Well, by now. Yeah, I know. Or did you forget? I used all the power you had to give, and Sora still beat me. I'm yeah, he sure did. Right when we um, fought to protect Kyrie. Very well. In that case, you shall sink into the abyss. Oh, baby! <laughs> All right. Oh, here we are in the realm of darkness. Is that his sentinel guy? Oh, I hate that guy behind him that oh, protects him and stuff. All right, here we go. Final fight with Ansem. Game on. Alright, what's he gonna do? Whoa. Alright. Yes, let's get our dark mode as fast as we can, right? As soon as he stops covering him. Okay. Zero. Oh, dang, we weren't fast enough. I'm waiting for that shock slash so we can break it, right? Oh, we're gonna duel him. Let's go, let's go, baby! Yes! That was good. That was really good. Oh, we missed. Ooh, okay, we got our dark mode. Now we can start freaking combo in his butt. Yes. Can we land another? No, he broke it with a zero, that punk. 
Yeah, Dark Break. Oh, Shock Slash? Yeah. Oh, man. That was like the luckiest zero that's ever been zeroed. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. I don't like that Dark Rush at all. Okay, we're getting a little low on HP. We need to save up our Mickeys if we can so we can get a reload as well, but... Here we go. We got our Dark... We got our Dark mode back. Oh no, it was only 19. Watch out. Oh man, that was crazy. Ooh, Dark Aura. Oh, he protected him right at the wrong time. Exactly at the worst possible moment. Well, at least when he does that like swing move, right? He doesn't paralyze us like he did when we were Sora in Kingdom Hearts 1. Ah, oh, dang it, he caught us. All right, so now that we know kind of his move sets and that shocking slash, we can look for that and uh, get him a little bit better. All right, so um, let's go back. Let's try this again. I just skipped the cutscenes. We just saw them. You know, it's all good. All right, we can get him this time. We're going to be patient. Let's try to just see if uh, Lexius will do anything for us, right? Like, no harm in that. A nine? Jeez, dude. Oh, he, see, he's resisting. I figured. I figured that it wouldn't let us just obliterate him. Can you imagine? If the Lexius card just let us destroy him, that would be so cool. <laughs> uh, do we have any zeros for that Shock Slash? No. Oh, but we can Dark Aura. Yeah, that's good. That'll be stronger in case he tries to use his Shock Slash. Ah, oh, crap. Nope. Oh, 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 dang it. We couldn't even break it. Nice. Ah. All right, we're getting low. Oh no, there was another Mickey. We should have saved it. Dang. All right, Dark Viraga, nice. Dark Break. Oh, we got him once, and then he broke our combo. Dang it, he got us again. All right, we're back. We've almost got Ansem. I'm like, oh my gosh, this is intense. Let's get uh, some Reach. I think that might help us. Oh man, oh, can we roll out? No, oh, that sucks if you get hit once. You're just like permanently stunned. I'm spamming. I was spamming square. All right, we're back. We've got Ansem at the same spot. Can we dodge out of the way here? Okay, we broke it. Golly. That move that he killed us with last time was so hard. If you get hit once, you're done. All right, let's get a heal on and um, get some Oogie Boogie. Oh my gosh. All right. We've really got to save our Mickeys. I just get overexcited and try to use it preempt you know like a little prematurely uh, okay all right we're good we're good he's on his last freaking bar of health we're down to eight cards this could be rough we've got to hit him oh my goodness okay good yeah yeah we used the time that he was reloading to use our potion that was good that was well timed boom oh my gosh can we can we can we Oh no! <laughs> Sentinel guy protected him. That was just the worst luck for us. Come on, baby! Yes! Oh, Ansem, you suck, man. Eat that fireball right in your stupid face. Oh man, that was intense. Yeah, that took me like four tries, I think, to beat him. Um, he's got pretty high value cards and he does pretty strong combos. So, I mean, there's, I don't know if there's a, a secret to him, like, like duel him or combo him or whatever, but definitely try to break his cards as much as possible. Yeah, nice, Riku. That was sweet. This is the end. This is hardly the end. Your darkness. I gave it all to you. My dark shadow lingers. Someday, someday, I will return. Okay, so we haven't defeated him for good. We've just suppressed him, right? We're just stronger than him, and we can push him down. Yeah, he's going to come back. we got to watch out. Kyrie. 
Is that Mickey? Gosh, Riku, I know yep. you wanted to do this alone, but you don't mind getting a little help, do you? <laughs> hey, no, I don't mind. Yeah, Mickey's here to to save us. Cool. Thanks, Mick. Is that the way out of Castle Oblivion? So, Riku, what happens next? Are you going home? I can't go home. Not yet. Hey, we've got to find Sora and Kairi. Oh, well, I guess really faint, but we've got to wake Sora it. up, right? So, I think his darkness may still have a hold on me. Your darkness belongs to you, just the same way your light does. Up till now, I thought darkness was something that should never exist. Then, I spent time with you, and Oh wow, even Mickey's life. had a paradigm shift. The road you chose, I didn't know. Light and dark, back hey, to back. Hey, light and dark, back to back. We've done that a lot with our inverse I burst, right? Mickey, you've been there. The what the heck, man? Nobody's seen before. Wonder where that road leads. I'd like to see myself. I'd like to walk the road with ya. <laughs> yeah, we're a team. Your Majesty, I'm really flattered. I don't know what to say. Gosh, Riku, you know you don't have to call me that now. We're pals. Ah, oh, what a guy. Mickey. <laughs> cool. He's our he's our He's our uh, new best friend. Ooh, look at us in our black coats. About to give some people the business. Hello, Diz. What are you making me choose now? Between the road to light and the road to darkness. Neither suits me. I'm taking the middle road. Do you mean the twilight road to nightfall? No. It's the road to dawn. All right. Well, that's it, guys. That's Kingdom Hearts Re Chain of Memories Reverse Rebirth. And that was a lot of fun. Those last cutscenes were really, really cool. So now Riku and King Mickey are going out, being pals. Riku is going to um, become stronger so th and try to find a way to get rid of Ansem altogether. And that'll be really cool. And Sora's asleep as Namine repairs his memories and puts them back the way that they should be. So we'll see what happens. Well, guys, I want to I want to once again thank you so much for coming and joining me. Here's a cutscene that we haven't seen. Riku seems to be struggling internally, right? He's having a hard time balancing his new powers or something. But there's Mickey to help him in a location we haven't yet seen, uh, and we won't see until we get into Kingdom Hearts 2. So here's also a character that we haven't seen. We know Axel, but we do know that that is Roxas. And uh, we'll see Roxas next week uh, as we, well, so I have the cutscenes for 358 over two days, but not the gameplay. So next week on my channel uh, will be the, three, five, the Kingdom Hearts 358 over two days cutscenes. So you can go check that out. We learn about Roxas and Shion and learn a lot more about the organization itself. So next week will be 358 over two days and then... Um, the week after that, we're going to get into Kingdom Hearts 2, so we ba we'll be back on a numbered title. I'm really excited to get back into that, but yeah, that is our Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories journey.
And that's it. Here we have some of our stats. Proud mode. 100% of the D report. <clears throat> One who reigns over cards was our collector rank. We did dark mode 239 times. And uh, we cleared it in 10 and a half hours. Defeating 3,500 enemies. Wow, you guys, this, this game was great. It was a lot of fun. I loved the story that was in there. So if you did like it, be sure to drop a like. And make sure you subscribe to see the rest of the series. I'll see you guys in the next video.